What's up guys, 2019 has been a year full of innovation in the whole technology sector including smartphone and in 2020 we are excited to see what new innovation that this smartphone industry will bring for us. In this video I am going to show you some of the innovative smartphones that are upcoming in 2020. Please hit the like button, do share this video and subscribe my channel. Xiaomi officially announced the Redmi K30 and K35G. Unlike a lot of people thought, the new lineup did not include a flagship class variant but only mid-rangers. According to the latest reports by the known leakster, Redmi K30 Pro will launch in the month of March 2020. It will be powered by the newly announced Snapdragon 865 chipset which is a Qualcomm's latest flagship chipset. The chipset will offer an integrated 5G modem Snapdragon X55 with the support of SA and NSA standards. The Redmi K30 Pro comes with a 120Hz refresh rate display which is of 6.67 inch with full HD plus resolution. The camera department include a Sony IMX686 sensor with a 64MP resolution supported by a 13MP ultra wide lens, 8MP telephoto lens and 2MP depth sensor. The front camera housed in the punch hole is said to have a 32MP sensor and a secondary tier of 3D sensor. Redmi K30 Pro is rumored to sport a 4500 mAh of battery with the support to a 30W fast charging technology. Links are given in the description, you can check the more details from there. OnePlus 8 series OnePlus will officially launch the new OnePlus 8 series in quarter 2 2020. But a lot of details already surfaced for the first time after a year. The upcoming smartphone series will be composed of three models and it will include an affordable variant too. OnePlus 8 and OnePlus 8 are set to house 6.4 and 6.7 inch displays respectively with Super AMOLED E3 technology and curved sides. There will be a dual punch hole display with a 120Hz refresh rate, resolution up to Quad HD+, and OnePlus 8 Lite that is a lighter version of OnePlus 8 is rumored to come with a 6.4 inch Super AMOLED E2 display with a 90Hz refresh rate. All of them will include an in-display fingerprint scanner. OnePlus 8 and OnePlus 8 Pro will be fueled by Snapdragon 8 65 chipset paired with 8GB and 12GB of RAM. The OnePlus 8 and OnePlus 8 Pro may feature a dual front camera with a 32MP sensor and a 3D TOF sensor, while the OnePlus 8 Lite is set to come with a 16MP front camera. OnePlus 8 and 8 Pro are set to be even better camera phones with a 64MP main sensor, 20MP ultra wide sensor, 12MP telephoto sensor with the support to 5x optical zoom and a 3D TOF sensor. Huawei P40 Despite the issues which came from the US ban, Huawei will unveil the P40 series in quarter 1 2020 and it will even launch it in Europe. The CEO Richard Yu already confirmed that it will be released in the month of March 2020. Huawei P40 will come with a never seen before design and improved camera department. It will not run Harmony OS which is the new Huawei's operating system based on Android. It will be still based on Android and it will run EMUI based on Android 10. But it will land in Europe without Google services, instead it will pack Huawei mobile services. Samsung Galaxy S11 series Just like every year, Samsung will unveil its main flagship lineup in quarter 1 2020, most likely in February or March 2020. Samsung Galaxy S11 which may debut alongside a clamshell version of the Samsung Galaxy Fold. Samsung Galaxy S11 is rumored to sport a 108MP sensor with 5x optical zoom in and 9-in-1 pixel binning. We also expect that Samsung Galaxy S11 to come with a Snapdragon 865 chipset in the US market and Exynos 990 chipset in the European market, both with an integrated 5G modem. Samsung Galaxy S11 may scan up to two fingerprints simultaneously. Its plus version may pack a 5000 mAh of battery manufactured by LG and it should come with a punch hole placed at the center of the panel just like the Samsung Galaxy Note 10 series. Oppo Find X2 Oppo is planning the launch of the perfect flagship smartphone in 2020. It will be the successor of the Oppo Find X and it will be called as Oppo Find X2. 
The company already confirmed that it will launch in quarter 1 2020. Among its main focuses, there will be an amazing display with a higher refresh rate than the previous generation we expect 120Hz refresh rate display as well as higher resolution that is up to Quad HD Plus resolution. Oppo Find X2 will be powered by the Snapdragon 865 chipset and it will be obviously supporting 5G network thanks to the Snapdragon X55 integrated modem. It might even come with an in-display camera technology thanks to which the front camera will be really under the display and not in the punch hole. Oppo Find X2 will be one of the most amazing camera phones as it is cheaper to come with Sony's latest image sensor with all pixel omnidirectional PDF as well as the new 2x2 on-chip lens solution. The new lens will offer faster and more accurate autofocus for better performance even in low light conditions. Realme X50 Alongside Xiaomi, even Realme is expected to release a mid-range series of smartphones with a 5G support in quarter 1 2020. The Realme X50 series will debut before the Chinese Spring Festival and it will include the brand's first 5G smartphone. The device will be probably be powered by the Snapdragon 765G chipset with an integrated Snapdragon X52 5G modem carrying the support to both SA and NSA 5G standards. It will be the main rival of the Redmi K30 5G. According to the rumors, Realme X50 will sport a 6.44 inch AMOLED display and a quad rear camera including Sony IMX686 main sensor with a 64MP resolution and secondary lens with 8, 2 and 2MP resolutions. The battery may have 4500mAh of capacity and support for and support WOOC 4.0 flash charging technology. It is set to come with up to 12GB of RAM and 256GB of internal storage as well as ColorOS 7 based on Android 10 out of the box. Links are given in the description, you can check the more details from there. So these are the new upcoming phones in the 2020 in quarter 1 and quarter 2. If you have any other phone in your mind that is upcoming in 2020, please comment in the comment section. Do share this video among your friends. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.